Here's a quick review of Never Again. Um, as you know, I'm a fan of book um, nuggets, book reviews. And here's what um, happened at a town hall meeting. Let's see. Mark Rubio, a week after the shooting, CNN hosted a town hall where we're supposed to have a calm and reasonable dialogue. And Fred Gutenberg, one of the fathers who lost a child, tried and failed to get Rubio to answer a simple question. Rubio said it was too complicated to separate hunting and combat weapons. And Cameron brought up the millions of dollars the senator took from the NRA. This is about people who are for making a difference to save us and people who prefer money. So he asked Rubio, would he no longer take NRA money? Rubio wouldn't say it. Cameron wouldn't let up. Right now, in the name of 17 people, you cannot ask the NRA to keep their money out of your campaign. I think in the name of 17 people, I can pledge to you that I will support any law that will prevent a killer like this. And Cameron said, no, I'm talking about NRA money. Rubio said money was on both sides of every issue and rambled on. And Cameron asked him the same question again. This time Rubio said he'd accept the help of anyone who agreed to his agenda. Your agenda is protecting us, right? So uh, David Hogue says, such a disrespectful teenager. This is why that matters. The dad had tried a respectful approach. This guy, Fred Gutenberg, he tried to observe normal decorum. Even though he lost a kid, he listened politely while Rubio explained the complexity of guns. We're just not going to play that game and history taught us that we had to do something different. The, 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 this is wonderful, something different. I think Cameron said it best. We don't respect you just because you have Senator in front of your name. That's a remarkable passage. So, uh, you know, we'll respect you if you stop taking money from the NRA. Pretty clear. So, um, profits from this book go to charity. And, well, I hope you'll at least look at it.